Shielding oneself can take place in many forms and for many reasons. For how long should one remain on guard, waiting, anticipating? These shielded pieces act as a type of metaphor for being guarded and protecting oneself from the world in all its different forms and all its different hurts. Life can throw all kinds of curveballs at you and in some aspects you have to put in mechanisms to keep yourself safe both mentally, spiritually, physically, and emotionally. And so for me, using this kind of armor but then putting the figure directly on it speaks to that kind of idea and that concept. Not hardening in the sense of being this kind of aggressive warrior, but a type of protection to ensure that you can navigate the spaces of life in a very successful way. So again, in this particular instance, the armor, the breastplate, has the figure directly in front of it. He's wearing it almost like a crown. And this kind of speaks to the mind as a very sensitive organ that we all have that needs to be guarded and protected. Lady Liberty, Liberated Lady. I titled her that because when I look at her, she reminds me of the Statue of Liberty, the way the rose sits at the top of her head, almost like the crown on the Statue of Liberty. For me, this piece starts to speak to being within this system, being a part of the system, but then also staking claim to it a bit of ownership, a bit of self-liberation, if you will. I'm gonna do what it is I have to do to make sure that I get the things out of life that I want. I love that notion of just being powerfully you and really standing in it.